where on earth am I? Hmm. I'm going to go ahead and guess that you're probably not on earth, given what happened last time. Hey guys, welcome back to After Work Gaming. We're back in the room for some more puzzle box gameplay. Last time, if you remember, we got sucked in through a doorway in Stonehenge. And I guess we ended up here, because you saw the null element in the cinematic. Uh, so we're going to go and start looking around. But first, let's read this note and then check out that thing. Uh, okay, we're going to copy that in a second. A queer sense of movement. Not quite turning, not quite falling. I felt myself cross the threshold and the visions abated. Perhaps they only serve to drive me to this place? The route back closes behind me, but a way forward opens ahead. Something is drawing on me. In case you are with me, I will try to guide you along the path. I pray you never came. I pray you are just another of my dreams. A.S. Nice. Okay, so let me quickly copy down that little diagram up in the corner right here. These are piano keys, let's say. Black keys, and the X's are on the inside. Okay? Okay. Now, anything here? A notepad with a sketch of the null element. Yes, thank you. Um, okay, let's start by looking at this box, and then we'll just clearly stuff on the edges of this table. So, uh -huh. nothing, nothing. Clearly will be something, though look like latches. That looks like a hinge, clearly, because look, there's the seam. There's another latch right there. Oh. Interesting. I think there might be some difference here, because look, there's a... Um... Yeah? Yeah, see, there's like a little... I mean, there looks like a little window in here, but more importantly, notice that's just a black seam. Get, get away, get away. I was trying to show something here. And that's a gold seam right there. There's like some metal there already. So I think this is a false latch. Anyway, that's just me. Uh, let's check this out. Um, okay, and that's clearly an indent for a key. I'm not reading your hints, man. I don't want that. Um, I think this, the thing with like the notes, there's a music theme thing in this, in this, in this chapter, uh, but the notes is probably the inside drum of whatever's on the box. Like this is... Like the wood panel is on the outside. And this little window, maybe it goes up and down. And then there's a key slot there. Okay. Uh, let's look on here. There's, well, there's a latch. That's not that hard to find. No idea. Okay. Can I click these? Can I click these? Click the, no. But there is a track here pretty, pretty clearly. Maybe this thing, because it looks like the track terminates here. Maybe this thing is going to move along the track somehow. Um, I don't know what these are, but... Yeah, see, there are some... Some of them do appear in this, like, scroll work, I guess. Okay, check this out. Solid. Hollow. One, two, three. With windows. Okay. Well, hold on. This thing moves down, right? Yeah. Aha. Okay, so this is what's going on. So these symbols along the edge here, I'm pretty sure you can move these. Yeah. Uh, so these symbols match symbols on here, and see this is hollow? So at some point, maybe we'll flip the switch here, and this will move... So that the scroll work, this like disc, is here, and whatever is in these three windows, we have to select here. I'm going to bet that that's how that puzzle works, but we'll get there in a second. This is way too much open space. Clearly something going on there. I'm here, and then we need either two things, because look, it's semicircles, or maybe a thing with two prongs. But okay, so let's do the switch first. Okay. I, I was wrong. Alright, fine. I'm man enough to admit that. Uh, okay, we're missing gears, because look, there's gears and these things turn, and they have to be a triangle and square base. Fine. Uh, and then we have this. Okay, let's do, when in doubt, always do the eyepiece. And there we go. Let's just do a quick once over on the table here. Nothing, nothing, nothing. Just the thing on the tabletop. And nothing at the top of the box. Okay. Line up the pattern. Just, just out of curiosity. Yeah. <laughs> you really need the eyepiece. Okay. Uh, there's a switch. Nothing else here. Take off the eyepiece. Ah, there's a little brass plate back there, which is probably a drawer. There you go. 
And we got our first cog, or gear, however you want to pronounce, whatever you want to call it. And it goes here because it's got the triangle base. Click. No, I was right. Look at that. And look at that. All right, but first things first, let's just see. BCC, here it is. So, the three symbols we need to find are the triangle, the same shape we've seen on pretty much every key we've ever found, and, or, you know, one of those manipulable, manipulable keys, and an S with some, like, weird scrolly growths. No, no. I beg your pardon? Okay, nobody cares about that right now. Probably later on, though. Okay, so this is... This is like this. This goes on the key, and this goes on the S with the scrolly, the scrolly growths. And we've got a coin. Talisman Curio Company Roller Organ Token. Okie dokie. Uh, what lo- oh yeah, this opened up. Hmm. Okay. No, stop it, come here. No. Oh, it goes back to its starting position, and... Uh-huh, okay. Alright, let's turn them all on. If something goes on here, if we do this. It does. Well, then we go like... <laughs> okay, so we need to turn them all on. It'll open up the path here, and then we need to come back here without, you know, messing up our... Because I'm guessing... Right? Well, so let's just assume. Yeah, see, they close up if you don't have them all on. Okay. So, off, switch, yeah, come here, down. Perfect. And we've moved this, and now we have a little switch. Switch, come on. The what? No, wait, there was a thing on top. A metal orb, oh, there it is. Metal orb, there's something strange about it. No? No. Um... This thing's pretty cool. Clearly missing a piece here. And, okay, well, I guess we'll... We need to find a piece with that little scroll work on it. Is, does this go here? No. Uh... Design. Okay, so there's a hinge. There's the seam. Oh, this is just colored this way. It's not just reflection. Check that out. Uh... We can move this, and this looks like the seam, so let's switch it. Let's turn it like this, maybe? Oh, there it is. Can we... Yes, we can! Totally press that, and... Really need to... Oh, check it out. Square base. Right? Yes. Small gear, square base. And this is no longer in inventory, which means we don't need it anymore. Which means, where's the gears? There it is. We put this here. Oh, this, this is why, remember we could focus on this for some reason? Come on, there it is. The drawer. This, I know where that goes. That goes into that weird little indent on the box. Strange lamp key, sure. And what is this? Some old fitted tarot cards. Kind of hoping you would provide a little more information than something I can see with my own eyes. Okay. Goes right here. This is the key. Okie dokie then. Uh... Alright, so let's go position two, right? Because look, dots. One dot, two dot, three dot. Inside moves? Maybe, but it hasn't done anything. Okay, fine. Let's flip the switch. Ah. Interesting. And now, what happens at position three? Oh! I didn't even know you could do that. Okay, position three. I just thought I just thought it was gonna be like up this way, this way. This. Okay, anyway, um, a key, and I know where that key goes because look at the shape. Okay, so no, 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 come here. There we go. Flip the window. Nice. 
now position. You might as well not be able to do it that way, man. It's just really cumbersome with the mouse for some reason. And we got a metal plate. Um, hmm. Where's the plate go? Oh, well, we know where this goes. Look, it has two little pips. So let's do the pips first. Hmm? It goes like this. Cool. Oh, check it out. So it would be... Nice. Looks like a coin slot. Thanks, man. Talisman Company. I wanted to see what's written on here, but I guess it means Talisman Company, and I'm assuming this says Roller Organ. Right? Talisman co Curio's Roller Organ. Alright, let's put the coin there. Right. Oh god. Please don't tell me I'm gonna be... ...playing that whole thing for you now. Nope, okay, never mind. Ooh. Ooh. What do I get? What's my prize? A metal handle. Actually, two metal handles. Um... Sure? I do like this thing, the fact that it like splits apart and stuff, that's pretty cool. Uh, okay, well, I have no idea what those handles are for, so let's go with the key. I beg your pardon? Yeah. Okay. And what happens if this is position one? Come on. Oh. Oh, 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 oh. Okay, hold on. I have an idea. Position three, please. At position three... Remember, because it'll it, it gives you, like, these little two things to set at position one. So, at position three... Oh. Oh, 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 oh. oh. I got that wrong. Position one... We'll tell you what these are. Position one, because you can't set these. Okay. At position one, we're told that position three has to be this weird harp, and position two has to be this thing with four notes. Okie dokie. Now, let's go with position three. One, two, three, four, five. Th th there it is. Okay. Position two. Two, thank you. It's this thing with the four. There it is. Nice. Now, I'm assuming we go back to position one. Thank you. Yes. Buttons. And check that out. I told you there was something squirrely about this hinge. No? No, I was totally wrong. Not squir something squirrely about the hinge at all. Just the there's a number system here. Okay. Okay, well, the... The shimmer tells me... Yeah. Oh, God. What happens if we... Yeah? Yeah. Okay. Five, seven. That's a three, isn't it? One more. Three. Five, seven, three. Okay. Well, that's simple enough. Five... Seven... Aha. Uh -huh. We can use the eyepiece here as well. What? Okay. Socket. Yeah, I get it. Yeah. Look at that. Hexagon shape with the flower. One goes here. One goes here. These rotate? Yeah, they do. Wait, what?
No, they can only go into the empty sockets. Oh, they only go into the empty sockets. Okay, fine, hold on. Oh, whoa, 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 whoa. Check it out. So we're rotating this cube, and when this faces away from us, that's when we... Okay. Okay, this one like this. So now we need top right, bottom left. Uh, yeah, top right, bottom left. That will be the same thing we just put up there, I think. Right, because this will end up being on the bottom right. What does this one do? Oh, okay. So let's put this here. This will be bottom left when it rotates. Perfect. Now, we've got one more. Need to rotate it so it's like this, which will be top right. Perfect. Cool. Oh, well, we know where that goes. A red gem in a metal plate. Okay. Oh, I would have sworn there was a little window in there. Totally wrong. Okay. Okay. Um, well, let's put this... Stop it. Put this thing here first. Ooh. Okay, no idea. Um, what's up with this thing? No? What about... Oh! Oh, and look at that little scroll... knot thing. Okay. Okay, well, we'll come back to that. What's this? Please move... Oh! Oh, 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 check it out. So these... these gems are caged? Right? Gems will not be caged for long. We'll see, because we're going to do that with them. Blue gem, okay. Sorry, I pronounced that very strangely. Uh, so let's do this. It's like a movement puzzle. This goes here. Green gem. All right, let's get that last one, which is yellow. Cool. This, this goes here. Goes up. This goes up. Let's not forget about this one. I don't want to clog the intake. There it is. Yellow gem. Cool. So these now slot here. Right? Uh, yeah. This. 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 Cool. What's going on if we put on the... Holy moly. Something's wrong. Ish. Ish? Ish. There do seem to be, like, these things do connect some somehow. Right, the blue and the green seems to have connected. But maybe they're just in different posi in the wrong position. Okay, so the red we can't move, right? Because the red is slotted where it is. But we can move these around, which means... If we do something like that. And this is the last time I'm going to blindly check it. And if it's not going to work, then what I'm going to do is I'm going to start putting them one by one into the right, into the positions. By themselves. And seeing what happens with... The Stop it. Stop it. I don't want to read the note. Seeing what happens with uh, patterns. Oh my god, I think we have to make this thing out of it. Look, the blue and the red are good. I think we need to switch... Here's what we need to do. We need to switch the green and the red and the yellow. That's what we need to do. Guaranteed. Not guaranteed, but probably. Or not. Hmm. Green's right. Na, 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 na. The blue we could probably move elsewhere, I think. Do it like this. Fix that pattern a little bit. No, totally screwed it up. Totally screwed it up. Okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Here we go. So, as expected, let's just do this. The way we should have been doing it in the first place. Um. No, so the green is actually out of place. Put the... Well, let's just continue working with the green. Green. Also out of place. The green was going here, right? Um, let's put the yellow here. I know that sort of violates my one-at-a-time rule, but, I mean... See? See? 
Green had to go there, yellow is in the right spot, blue goes here, and now I can see it, it's finished. There it is. Okay. Whoa. Oh, okay. It's one of these. It's a maze. Can we rotate it? No. Can we... Yes, we can. Okay. So, like that. Assuming... Yeah? Yeah, there it is. So, line it up. There it is. Now we go like this. Go like this. Oh, here it is. Do -do -do, like that. Like this. And now let's see... Right. Okay, so we want to go like this because it'll it'll link up with this piece in another click. Check it out. Right, like here. And then we're good. Okay, cool. Uh, right? Ah. Sure. Oh. Um, okay. Is it... Yes. Okay. We, we get to do that again. Except in a different spot. Okay, fine. Now, we have to get there. Let's see what we have. We need to get it onto this weird little, like, curve. First thing is this. Then it's this. Then, let's just see what links up with this. This one links up with it for sure. Yeah, okay. We need to put it here. Because in two clicks, it will go here. Then it links up with this S. And then we're good. Cool. Another one of these puzzles. Okay. Eyepiece. Um, not really... Can we move it? Oh, we can. Let's just line it. There it is. There's the pattern. Nice. Uh, I have lost all of my controls now. Ooh. This is not great. Game complete! You made it through, unflustered, I hope, as there were, as there will surely be sterner tests to come. You've taken the first step on a longer journey. I see no benefit in hiding the truth from of your predicament. There is no way back, not for any of us. For now, you are as trapped as I. Press forward with heart, my friend. There are many more rooms ahead. Well, we know there's at least one more. Well, two more, really. Uh, okay, so that's it. Um, pretty fun. I mean, you know, look, it's puzzle boxes. There's not a lot in the way of story, but that's fine. This thing is designed for somebody to sort of, like, spend a little time on their iPad and, and solve some puzzles. Uh, still, very, very beautiful, very intricately designed mechanisms, which are super cool. Uh, thank you guys for hanging out with me. I am going to start in on the room, too. You guys made that pretty clear to me that you want to see the next one. And, uh, yeah. We'll go from there. So, if you like this one, like, comment, subscribe, tell a friend, let me know that I'm doing something right, let me know that you guys want to see more of this stuff. If you have thoughts, comments, if you, I don't know, want me to play something else or have any sort of other ideas, by all means, leave a comment. Everything's welcome. And in any case, I'll see you all next time. Brother, <laughs> <laughs>